Hey, I'm just Vosco and we're back in Transport Fever 2. Now, last time we left off, we set up a new map, new new routes. Trying to make things look a bit better, like we've got these new little workshop items that give us these little barns and things like that. That's a little one. Let's find a bigger one. Like this. Lovely. And our routes are actually really profitable. If we look here, really profitable. Things are going well. We are making money. We've got a million pounds. And I'm thinking we should set up this line here for wood. We could put a... Yeah, do you know what? Let's do it. Let's spend a bit of money. We could put a road depot in here to start with. So let's get that in. How, oh, how about we put one of these in first, actually? Let me hold shift and get it so it's lined up nicely with the building. We'll put that one in there. And then we'll put a road depot next to it, like so. We will close that and we're going to configure this one. So let's delete what there is. I really don't like the basic start, like the, what, what I've just deleted, because we're in 1853 and it's got modern lampposts and things on it. It's not ideal. Uh, let's do that. So let's go and set two more up. One at each of the, one at each of the forests. Possibly as far away as possible, just to make the route smaller, basically. So here would be good. Can we keep going? How far can we go? There is actually, we can we can go that far away, which I find really weird. Uh, let's line that up a little bit more, just like that. And we'll put the other one in while we're at it and then configure them both at the same time. What, we can go to there, really? Okay, that's what it says. That's what we're going to do. So we're going to configure that one, same as we've done with the others. We're just going to get some of these on. I might just put the open ones on here, just so the wood's covered from the elements. And the same with this one. Let's configure it. We don't need to pick up points and drop off points. It's just a waste of time. We're, we're, we're spending too much money maintaining both sides. I know we've got two on one side, but I'm planning for the future, you see. So let's set up a new line. That will go from there and it will go to here. Excellent. We're going to call that um, wood one siren. There we go. So we know where it is. And we're going to set up a new line from here. Hello, add station from here to here. We're going to call that wood two siren. There we go. Lovely. Now we just need to get some vehicles on it. So if we go into here and select vehicles, we want this one. We want 10 of them. And we're going to set that up on wood one siren. And then we're going to do the same thing again for wood siren two. Uh, 10 of those, please. Thank you very much. Bye. And they're going on wood to siren. There we go. So they'll get underway and start making us a bit more money. That cost us half a million pounds to do that. Wow. Siren, Sester and Stroud is screaming out for a passenger service, I feel, along this road. But I'm not sure I want to get into passengers at the moment. We are making steel over here and we're making steel over here. Both places would be ideal to go into here and produce, start producing goods. We do need, what else do we need? What's this? Plastic. I've never done plastic before. That is something we definitely need to set up. We don't have a lot of oil around here. So that'll be shipped in by train at a later date from the looks of it. We do have two core and a coal mine, which we could bring down into here. That's quite a route, but I think it's worth it. Because we definitely need more iron. We've got no stock of iron coming into here, as well, in stock at all. So where's that one's iron? We could come straight across and join onto this road. Huh. I'm actually tempted to do that. Is that a long distance? That's probably no more than 
than this one over here, is it? No, we'll do it. Let's do it. Let's spend some more money. We can always make some more money at a later date. So if we bring you to there and then bring you onto that road. Whoa, I don't want to do that. No, 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 no. We don't want a tunnel. We just want a nice normal road going on to there. Thank you very much. And then it's going to go through the other side. So we end up with a cross junction. And then here we're going to go straight across onto there. Beautiful. Now let's get a building. We're going to get one of these. Probably... Do you know... Logically, I want to pull it as far away as possible to make the route smaller. But I just feel it looks nicer being closer. It looks like it's part of the industry. I don't know. We'll go with it here. So let's delete that and that. We can get some cargo buildings. I might just put some open tops. Maybe an open top and a closed. How about that? Perfect. Then we can set up a new route, which will be going from there. And it's going to go... Where are we heading? We're heading to there. That's quite a route. But that is iron, isn't it? And we need iron. So we're going to call this... Um, iron... No, let's do it right. Iron 3. Like so. Now we can go into here and get some vehicles. Is there any depots closer? There's not, is there? No, because I think all my farm ones came out of there as well, didn't they? Yeah, so that's fine. So we're going to go buy vehicle. We're going to choose that. We'll go 10 of them. And those are going on iron 3. There we go. Perfect. So they'll head out as well and start bringing iron in. Obviously, once we can get an upgrade on the vehicle, that will help situations. And there was this one up here, wasn't there? Coal. Ah. Although I'm tempted to bring this iron in and just bring a road straight down onto here. That might be an idea. So if we pick up on the end of there. No, don't like that. Why do you not like that? Oh, it does. It's just been funny. Uh, let's go down there and then we're going to join you onto here. We can go and get one of these and put it up here. Let's rotate it round so it's in the right location. Line it up a bit better. Pop that there. Then we can edit it. Configure. We do not need both of them, so we'll get rid of that. We're going to go cargo. And I think we'll go for two clothes this time. Just so they don't all feel the same. Excellent. And then we can get a line put in. So go new line. We're going to go from here and you're going to come all the way down to here. Perfect. And we can call that one Iron 4 now, isn't it? Yeah, we've got four irons coming in. Excellent. We'll get 10 more vehicles. I would like that one. And I would like 10. And I want to buy. And I can't afford it. Wow. Our money went down quick. But we should start seeing money rolling again as long as I stop spending. I just want to get these ones going and then we can skip a bit of time and hopefully sort of build up our our takings again, as it were. That would be nice. We're slowly building up to this. We're on 200. A little bit more. Come on, you can do it. Tiny bit more. There we go. Buy those. And they're going to go on iron four. Brilliant. So I'm going to let it play on for a little bit and build up our money again. And I will bring you back. Okay, we've got a bit more money now. Things are working well. If you've noticed the date hasn't changed, that is because I'm taking advantage of this date speed thing. So when I go off to make money... Um, the date doesn't change because I turn it off, so we're not sort of missing a load of eras and things like that. I think we're making money across the board, apart from Iron 3 is not making money, which is this route here, right? Is that just because they haven't run enough yet? They've got a long old route to go. They've got to go from here all the way down to here. But they will make money. I'm keeping an eye on this because if this gets too... 
Mm, it is getting a bit quite compact. Maybe we should configure this and add... Can I add another drop of point that's not connected onto there? Hmm. No, I want you to be separate. Street access. So we can only build to the side of it. Ooh, I thought we could do like a leave a gap and then do another one. That is not the case. Okay, let's do a bit of rearranging then. So we'll close that. We're going to get a road. I'm probably going to go with the middle road size like that. Um, we'll bring that... Can I have that straight, please? Thank you. You can come up to there like that. How about that? Yeah, that's not too much money. We'll do that. And then we can delete this road. Like that. And then we can go on to here. We can go configure. And hopefully we can add another one of these. Like so. We could actually add another four. But I think one will be fine for now. So then if we go to terminals, we can say, we can go code two, terminal one, and then code one, terminal one. So we've got code going in on this terminal, iron on these two terminals, which would probably make sense if iron was on these two, but that's how it's gonna work at the time being. So that definitely should help situations there. We should, shouldn't get so much of a tail back on them how are we doing profit wise iron 3 is making a profit now which is good okay so where else do we want to set up some infrastructure we've got that going on which is producing planks do we need planks anywhere in the location not really this is probably a good route here bringing the the quarry over to make bricks that is an option not the best option at the moment, I don't think, but an option. You're making steel. We, we could start getting a train line in to bring the steel into here. That might be a good option. Now, trains work out expensive. I, I was hoping to do passenger trains first. Are we going to get a train line in here? Let's have a look. So if I go buildings... We can go, I've got a few more things here now. Look, we've got a UK generic passenger station. Cargo stations, what have we got? Ter cargo terminus station. Oh, so that's where it terminates. Which would probably work out better, would it? I don't know. Let's go with the normal one, I think. We can rotate that round. And if I hold shift, I can line it up with the road better. And we could put that one in there, right? Let me just check. So then we're going to go up to here. And then this one's going to come in from this side to there. Do you know, I think that's a good idea. I just think that's too far for road vehicles to take it. So that's going to work out quite expensive there, isn't it? Huh. Is it going to flatten all of it or just that bit? No, we did flatten all of it. That's good. So we can do that. Then we want one. Uh, let's slow the game down slightly. Where do we want you? We want you over here. Hmm. Now if I bring... Do I need a road for this? I don't think I do, do I? I'm tempted to bring it in this side so it sits in there nicely if we hold shift and just line it up a bit nicer we could do that and then if we get off of here we can go configure we can probably oh i've got some new things what's this walls and fences tracks if i put a second track in like so i might make it a bit longer for future use uh, we do have some new platforms. Cargo buildings, platforms. Now, are these for passengers? P 
Passenger, passenger. Yeah, passenger ones, those are. Passenger waiting room. Ah, oh, we get a waiting room? Okay, no, we can't do that at the minute. Don't get distracted. Let's go there, 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 and there. Just to make it long enough. And then we can go... I quite like the idea of fencing. What have we got? What's... Look at that. How nice does that look? Oh, I like it. So if you go all the way along there, just so it feels enclosed. I'm going to put it there as well. And possibly leave that. Can I get a cargo build in there just to make it feel... Wow, that is a big cargo building. Maybe not that big. Large, large, medium. Like so. No, don't like that. Too close to the road. That's annoying. Are you small? No, you're medium as well. Hmm. That's the same as that. That's going to be the same as that. That's a shame. That would have looked really nice in there. Can you go the other side? No, you just can't go there at all, can you? Oh, poop. Miscellaneous. What have we got here? Side entrance. Okay. We're still not going to use that one on here, but that's good for a passenger one. Um, let's go back in and get some tracks. Now, we want to go down to here. So, we're going to have to click on there and then come out this way, I think. Yes. Is that, a, that bends quite tight, isn't it? What if we go more there? And then it's pretty much a straight run. We should probably go around the hill. So if I go that way and then... Oh, we're going to get a tunnel. Do you know what? I don't mind a tunnel. How much is that going to cost us? A million pounds. Wow. Although it's going to cost... Yeah, we might as well put it in. Let's do it. Is that tunneling? It's not tun... Oh, it is tunneling. Yeah, that's fine. So do that. Like so. And then we need to make it that direction. So I'm probably just... No, I don't want a raised bit. Please don't put a raised bit in. Probably just going to go across the road like that. So we have a cross in there. Because we don't need to bridge all the roads. There's not enough traffic on the roads to worry about that, really. Let's go this way. No, I don't want to bridge. I want you to stay flat. Small bits at a time. Oh, there. That's good. That's cheap. There we go. Perfect. We are spending a lot of money, but hopefully it will be worth it. You're going to raise up there, are you? That's nice. Why are you going lower this end? Hmm, no, I don't like that. Hmm. Have I got different choices in these? I do. Look at that. Can we keep this end high? And then just go straight across the road with it? So if I go up, right... Is that up? No, that's down. I don't want you to get lower. I want you to stay the same height all the way along. So if I do that, maybe. Is that the colour I want? I quite like that brick bridge. Hmm. Okay, wait, 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 wait. If we... Where are we? Let's, let's line up properly. You're coming along that way. So if we can raise you up there and then go across in the same color would be good. Ooh, that one, wasn't it? I'm sure it was that one. So if we can do that and then you can just join on to there, right? Yes, that's going to cost me a bit of money, but that's fine. Because we have trucks running. We're going to have trucks. Well, I say trucks. Horse and carts running down here. So I don't really want to interfere with them yet. And then here, if you come... Hmm, let's have a look. If you come around... No, I don't want you up there. I want you ground level now, please. Thank you. So if you come around here, 
No? I've still got you raised. Why? Uh, lower, please. No, one of these lowers. There we go. Back on ground level. So if you come around here... Not in a straight line, please. Yeah, like that. And then we can join you up and you can have a nice steady decline there. Yeah, I think that's good. Have you matched up the brickwork? You have. No. Yes, that's fine. Okay, so we'll do that. Perfect. And that's bringing us quite close to our station now. So then you just need to flow around here. Keep flowing this way. You are going to cross the road here, but that's fine. It is only going to be one train coming through here. So if you go that way and then from there join onto that. That's good, right? That's not the best cutout, but I don't mind it. It can stay there. Perfect. So, I've actually gone to the effort of putting some bushes and trees in down here. Because I'm on sandbox mode, it allows me to put these in. I think that's a really nice little touch. Now, uh, what's this? Is this like a... Just a support? <gasps> we can put lampposts in. Oh, let's put one of those in there. It got rid of the bush, but that's fine. I'm happy with that. What's this, then? Brush size, one. Oh, just random trees. Okay. And we can put fencing in? If I was click and drag, that would definitely be worth it. But I am not sitting there putting all these individual pieces of fencing. So, now, that runs through there perfectly. Goes round the farm. And then ends up in there. Which is good. Where do we want to put a depot, though? Possibly over here, actually, because we've got a lot going on in this area. So let's grab a train depot. We are going to rotate it round. Or press the wrong button completely, of course. Uh, may I rotate you? Thank you. Um, hmm. Decisions, decisions. I might pull it on and because we want it to be able to go into that station first so maybe that's not the best place for it what have we got around here maybe over here actually because we do want it oh no I've lowered it now why have I done that go here raise you up thank you and then we'll put you over here yeah definitely here so if I do that, and then we grab some track, and then you can go on to there. Perfect. And then this one, that's probably going to be too tight there, actually. So if we come off of here and go that way, can you join onto there? You should be able to. I forgot this is raised here, actually. Hmm. That's a bit of a crappy location for this, then. Is that going to work? Too much curve. Oh, poopity poop. I suppose that's okay for the time being, because we can run this line, at least. So if we go new line, we're going to go that one. We're going to click on here, and we want it to go from here, and we want it to take it into this station here. And let's call that one Steel 1. Just so we know what it is. Uh, we can go to here. We can get a vehicle. And what have we got? We've only got steam. We've got that steam locomotive there. That's it. The D13. That's a very small locomotive. Uh, we want to pick up cargo and we want to pick up steel, which is that one. Can I change the colour of that train, actually? I didn't look. Can oh, we can. So we can put our colour on it. Oh, no, that looks terrible. Huh. Maybe black. Let's go black. Then we'll go cargo, that one. I 
don't particularly want black on there. Can we have like a burgundy color? Yeah, that one. Uh, so let's go one, two, three. We didn't add the train. Why didn't we add the train? Might go gray actually, there we go. So add the train and then go back. <laughs> Back to cargo, we're gonna go for a burgundy color again. And we want this one. We're on mediocre so far. Mediocre's okay though, right? Let's have a look at speed. It can do 25 miles per hour. One, two, three, maybe six, shall we go for the time being? And we don't have enough money for that, which is really annoying. Uh, build the headquarters of your company in a location of your choice. Thank you for that tip. I will do that. Huh. Can we have some more money, please? Let's speed it up. We'll get some money flowing in. Shouldn't take too long to get up to what we need. We only need 943,000. We're at 700. It's flying up already. These trains are not great, are they? Hopefully we can unlock some new vehicles which have a bit faster and more pulling power but this one should do okay to start us off if it doesn't make money we may have to look at shutting the route down but i'm hoping it will make money taking the steel for us uh how are we doing 778 i don't want to close this window because i'm going to lose this then and i don't want to do that can we have some more money please there's just so many vehicles pouring into this area I love it. This is like our little hub at the moment. Okay, money's going up, money's going down, money's going up, down, up, down, up, down. What are we on? 767, we're getting closer. Okay, we're gonna hit 800 at least, that's close. Nope. All our expenses have just gone out. We may have to leave the train for the time being. The issue is, if I don't do it now, I'm going to start working on the, the, the line going the other direction. And that's going to cost money, and I don't want to do that. I'd quite happily get this train running, end the episode, build up some money ready for the next episode, and get the other train running then. So we're on 816. Come on, so close! Yeah, I don't think it's going to do it. Okay, I'm going to end the episode there. In the meantime before the next episode i'll set this train up running backwards and forwards taking steel hopefully that will help our money situation uh if you've enjoyed this episode please hit that like button and if you haven't done already please subscribe it really does help the channel and until next time i'll see you again